Well, I just got off of work and I've been tagged by the bearded Burton for an EDC dump. I'm uh, going to go ahead and get closer here and I'll show you what I got. Okay, I always have my phone on me usually. Um, I usually have a pair of sunglasses. As you can see there, I just got off of work so I have a mechanical pencil, pad of paper. This is a Kershaw. I couldn't tell you what kind it is. Um, I just totally demolished this blade at work. I usually use it to, uh, maybe you can see that, sca scrape little pieces of grout or concrete off and sharpen some pencils as you can see. Nothing special. Uh, I just like having one that I can just, you know, tear up. It's definitely not sharp, usually at the tip. Um, usually is not too bad here towards the back. That's a pocket knife I always carry. I always have my wallet. Um, I'll show you a few things that I have in there. Um, set of keys. Lots and lots of keys to various things for work and home. Um, this is my true EDC that I have. Just a little mag light, which I've been meaning to actually replace. I don't know why I haven't. I've had this mag light forever and I have to change the batteries in it every so often. But I've been meaning to change that out with this TI3 uh, by through night. Through night. Um, have a pair of fingernail clippers. Truthfully, I use those quite a bit. A lot of times, just clip my nails or get a hangnail or I've used it to cut cordage with, clean underneath my fingernails. I've got this ferro rod that's in there. Got this tick twister. Love this thing. If you're gonna remove a tick, this is this is my new for sure way to do it. I I would not choose another way to do it. Uh, do a lot of painting once in a while at work uh, like I did this week. So I have a paint can opener. This is a whistle. I don't know exactly what brand this is. I do believe I got this off of County Com. And a lot of this this uh, lanyard here I got off of County Com also. It's a government surplus site. Uh, and this just unscrews to get anything off of it. It's pretty nice. Uh, one of my other favorite, favorite things on here is actually this set of tweezers here. And that just comes off of there. I've never lost this, so it holds very well. But uh, those tweezers will get pinpoint accuracy to pull out um, <laughs> all kinds of things. This is something I got for uh, sacks that I got for my, uh, oh, it was a Christmas gift, I think, I believe. But, of course, you know, uh, it's got a toothpick and tweezers. One thing that I've done that I haven't seen everybody do, but that little dot right there is a sewing needle stuffed in that little hole that's in every one of these. Um, I particularly uh, asked for this particular one just because I didn't want one that was too big, but I definitely wanted one that had a pair of scissors on it. Now, I don't have very good fingernails, so it's usually hard for me to get something out like this. But I wanted the pair of scissors, and the reason I wanted those is because when I'm hiking and whatnot, I'll use the uh, moleskin, and this works great for cutting little circles uh, to, for the moleskin because square corners usually get snagged up pretty easy. That, and this has a nice saw on it, has an awl. Uh, maybe show you guys more about that another day. Very nice sharp blade. You can see that I've carried this quite a bit. Um, let's see what else I got. Oh, I just happened to have a carpenter's pencil in my pocket. I was doing some tile work today. Um, oh, got a belt here. This is something I always carry. I always carry actually all of this, except for the pencils and the pad of paper. Um, my belt, I've used this many, many, many times to uh, strop my stuff. This is also my Super Tool 300. 
which I've had forever. It, it comes un, unbuttoned all the time because that snap's been snapped in and out so much. But I have another ferro rod on here. Um, got some extra cordage down in this little pouch in the front. Um, it's a pretty decent size hank. And then of course, Super Tool at 300. I mean, you can see how much use I've got. I, I use this thing almost literally every day. Uh, at least once a day. But, uh, love it. I particularly don't want another one. If I lost this one, this is what I would get. Um, so let me go ahead and pull some things out of my wallet to show you a few other things I've got in there. I, uh, have a Fresnel lens in here. This, of course, is if I can find it. There it is. It's got its protective cover on it. Um, that's another thing. I know I got something else in here. Uh, these are th things in my wallet are usually things that I slightly forget about. I don't remember them as much. But this is just some of it I'd call it a gimmick uh, but it does work if you need it to of course I just clip my fingernail so I'm gonna struggle with this but it's a, another knife and uh, you just fold that over and in a pinch if you needed it there's another sharp blade and it is sharp that's a nice little thumb ramp right there it's, it's you know, something that goes in your wallet, it's, I wouldn't completely call it cheesy because it does work, but you wouldn't be able to put a lot of force on it. But you could shave down some feathers or make some notches, it just take you a little bit longer. So, there is mine. I'll put, uh, I'll put the uh, list of other three people in the description box there. Put this up so anyway guys hope you enjoyed that try to get some more videos out I've been extremely busy I'm working on tilling up a good spot for a garden uh, been doing a lot of family stuff I'll show you some new gear that I've gotten um, here I'll flip you around real fast you guys will like this I'll show you kind of a sneak peek of what to possibly expect here soon all right, I'm not the best artist, but uh, that should give you a, uh, a hint. The three people I'm going to go ahead and tag is Outdoorsman Paradise, Buckskin88, and Lee Ralph. Have fun!